Welcome back to my gameplay series for Man of Medan in 4K at 60 FPS. This is Playing 101 and this is where we left off last time. I would like to thank all you guys, all those of you who have been uh, really supportive of me by subscribing to my channel. Thanks for all the love and uh, again support guys. Get off this damn ship. Yeah. Yeah, I have no idea what the fuck's going to happen now, but this game is getting more and more interesting. I actually haven't played in... Whoa. That was loud. Bullet casing, right? I know it sounds crazy, but maybe it was these guns that took down the plane from our dive. So this is what I've learned so far. To not pick up weapons. Because it's not bullets that are killing people. Well, it is actually bullets and knives and all that stuff. But it's mostly, uh, you know, us reacting to that gas that is uh, basically making us kill ourselves. And I have a feeling that I am responsible for killing, killing Brad. I think his name is Brad. That shouldn't have happened. Great. Could have used these if they weren't Swiss cheese. You could still probably patch them up, right? Anyway, let's get the fuck out of here. So, I, I already picked up a um, knife. Which I shouldn't have. And I think we ended up killing the other dude. Alex's brother. Which is totally messed up, but, you know, I didn't really know. Well, I kind of had an inclination, but I wasn't thinking it through. Oh, wrong button. Found a way up? Sadly, no, but I'll keep my eyes open. I see a chain dangling over there. Maybe we can just, uh... Climb through there. Uh, some. Oh, damn. I had a feeling. Gas mask instructions. Always ensure your mask is fitted before assisting anyone else with theirs. If you detect gas or hear the gas alarm, do not panic. Remain calm and clearly shout gas, gas, gas uh, to warn anyone in the vicinity. Hold your breath. If you're wearing a fucking gas mask, why do you need to hold your breath? A cha- a, a cha- Attach the gas mask carrier by placing the bag under your left arm. I guess you're not wearing a gas mask yet. Pull the shoulder sling over your right shoulder and hook it onto the bag. Hook the belt around your- You know what? I don't need to read that, but it would be awesome to get the gas mask. Can we grab that shit? Wait, dude. Maybe it- Let's, let's just go through that thing. Maybe you cannot wear one until you read the instructions. No? Can I grab that gas mask or no? Damn it. Well, that's stupid. All that excitement for nothing. Can I grab the damn gas mask? Are you sure? Let me, let me just... Can I move up? No? No? Uh, okay. Dawn. So yeah, a gas mask would be really helpful right now. Except, uh, turns out we can't really grab that thing, so... Okay, fair enough. So, our goal is to stay away from the gas, since we don't have a freaking gas mask. Hey, a little help over here. I think this is our way up. Give yeah, me a look. think. She is strong. I'll pull you up. What about your girlfriend?
Okay, let's get going. What happened to the uh, captain? I forgot her name. So there are two spots to go. Ah, uh, this looks like a dead end, so it doesn't really matter. I'm still a little confused. Why were we not allowed to grab that gas mask? Was it broken? Did we not use our domes enough, or what? what's going on? Alright, looks like we have to go back in there. But before going... Oh, shit. You know what? Let's just go back in there. Over here! Got a way through here. Oh, shit. Okay. Ugh. Maybe we should have gone out and explored a little bit more. Darn it. Ah, uh, damn it. Fudge cake, dude. Alright, I messed up. So we can't really go back out there. Okay, stick to the knowledge that you have now. Oh, shit. Logbook. All right, sweet. Can I read this thing or? Huh. Last log shows him caught in a storm. A swell from the weather. Oh, what? Wheat waves? 20 feet. No damage reported. PM. Weather continues to deteriorate as does forecast. Crew bearing up. AM wind at storm force gaining strength weather is exceptional with several lightning uh, strikes uh, hitting OM what is OM oh it's probably the name of the ship something Medan um, but causing no sustained damage we are leaking some water but it is under control navigator ports seabed depth readable all right let's get the hell out of here Okay, so again, no weapons, be careful, try to, uh, try to not attack each other, and stay away from the gas. Ah, shit, there are two doors. What do I take? Left or right? Three doors. Wonderful. No, that is not a door, that is a premonition. So one of the, um... Pirates will kill themselves. Not necessarily a bad thing. Unless it's, uh... Got something to do with us. And we will be hallucinating. This game is a mindfuck. Alright, bro. Can you... Oh, we can't really go that way. Okay, it's a dead end. Can we look at this dude or no? No. Alright. Alright, so there's a door here that we did not open or explore. Locked. So there's only one door that we can use, which is uh, good in a way. Okay, let's get the fuck out of here. Find the radio yet? No, but there's got to be a radio on this ship. There, there has to be. I mean, it is an old ship. God knows. Oh, is that another portrait? 
No, that's just a map, right? Okay, how do you interact? There you go. Something's wrong here. If you were headed to San Francisco, you'd be crazy to take this route. It's almost like they didn't want anyone to know they were coming. Like hide and seek out in the ocean? Yeah, I don't really get the route. Um, I don't know what the blue means or what the red means. The blue kind of looks like moving from either the United States to China or the other way around. Actually, China to the United States of America. But I, I don't really know. Uh, ship was blown off course. Cloud cover was bad. They couldn't establish a position. Oh, that's what happened. Heavy cloud cover. Is, okay. Unable to establish location. So they were lost. Alright, cool. Am I missing anything else here? Or... Oh, there's the radio. Take a look. No freaking way. This thing actually still works? Look, radio science hasn't changed much in 70 years. As long as there's power. I'll give it a whirl. Ah, it's working. It's a number station. Military bandit. Let's ask them for help. Hey, hey, is anyone out there hearing this? Hello? Shit, we got him. Uh, if you can hear us, we're on a ship, an old freighter. Our coordinates are approximately uh, 12 degrees 30 minutes south, 151 degrees 20 minutes west. Please get here now. We need help. Please repeat. Please repeat. Uh oh. We're on a freighter, abandoned, huge and old. Hello? Hello? Is anyone out there? Please, come in. Oh, people are disappearing and reappearing. Look at this. Ugh. This has got to lead somewhere. Maybe we can find a way to get the power back. I wouldn't go we down there. We need to get that radio working. I think someone should wait here in case a message comes through. I'll go, obviously. I'm coming too. <laughs> hey, what? Julia, no. Uh, you're not always gonna be there to protect big guy. I can handle this, trust me. Whoa, whoa. If Julia says she can handle it, she can handle it. Case closed. All right, you and me, Julia. Wonderful. <laughs> she dead? She has a cut. Broken bones. Everything still work? Is everyone all right? I'm okay. Do you see anything? We're gonna have to find the generator. If we can get it started, we can power up the radio. I'll wait here by the radio. Here. Come on, nice catch. All right, so I just saw the gas at the bottom on the floor. That's not good. After you. 
All right, so this is uh, not great. We're stuck down here. We need some fresh air, so we need to try and like we're in the lower levels of the ship. move ASAP. Move quickly. Try and find some fresh air somehow. I don't, I don't know how. Oh, that is where people were stuck in the beginning. Minister meeting between scientists X, blah, blah, blah. Bishop C.W. Palmer. Meeting with our team says we can mutually learn for the same thing. The Western world must be protected from. As it states, I've been aware of certain agencies investigating chemical and biological agency in warfare. I knew it. Our act limited by the Geneva Protocol have experiments we are unable to. That describes the an investigation during to test the uh, effects of uh, human subjects of the molecule crystal structure hallucinogens codename Manchurian gold. Uh, that's exactly what they were carrying. Chemical mu munitions battle. It was uh, even relatively minor observed to trigger significant hallucinations. Men highly convincing subjects hearing things that really were not there even the danger was man manifold uh, oh manifold and uh, no, okay cool so yeah we we killed brad god damn it all right so what the fuck is that so it looks like there was some sort of fight and this charlie went to the brig all right don't really care about that we know exactly what happened we need to get the fuck out of here we need to not breathe in that gas. So that's exactly what happened. Shipwrecked. Container got leaked. Everyone was contaminated. They breathed in the air. They started killing one another. And you get the point. Petty theft. One day break small items. Blah, 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 blah. Wednesday. Okay, again, don't care. The one thing that remains unexplained so far to me is the ship. I'm gonna need a hundred hot baths if we ever get out of here. We're the gonna get out of here, Julia. I hope you're right. I might have a run. The ship was sunken. How the hell is it floating now? Okay, get get out get out of my way. Please. Love you. But but get out of my way. Do I really have time to read all this? Patient name, history of case, diagnosis, mild neurosis, disability, not the result of his own misconduct, and blah, 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 blah. Requested Patterson see me today as I believe his panic to be accompanied by vivid and disturbing memories in the past. Continued to do his symptom appear. Oh, clear case of Kosor. I don't know what Kosor is, but it's a chemical overdose something wow. right. Jesus Jesus right okay um let's hurry we cannot stay here we generally cannot stay here we're gonna get them both killed or one of them killed don't care don't Might care the son of someone on board yeah totally all right get out of here Maybe I should not be doing any exploring. But if we don't explore, we can't find the, um... The power. What is that? Nothing. Are we going down? That is a dead end. So I guess we are going down. Come take a look. Look, down there. What? I think that's the engine room. Good place to find the generator, right? Let's find out. Shit. No more ladder. I can drop the rest of the way. Wait. <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah. Fine. Come on down. How on earth are they gonna go back up? <laughs> Jesus! What's up? Uh, you didn't fucking see that? Right. No. Of course you didn't. Um, 
Hello? Yeah, I think I'm actually seeing clearly for the first time in a while. Nothing jumped out at me. So, the ship was carrying Manchurian gold. But that turned out not to be gold at all. It's a toxic chemical. And there's this weird fog everywhere, right? Well, maybe that's Manchurian gold. And maybe we're breathing it in and it's fucking us right the hell up. I sure as shit saw some stuff I cannot believe. And maybe I was right not to believe it. I was hallucinating. I guess it makes sense, though. We know the crew were scared shitless of something. Yeah. They're all seeing this crazy shit going down and they all thought it was real. This couldn't have anything to do with the plane wreck we dived. I don't know. It seems like the plane came in contact with the ship, but it's just a theory. Oh, God. All right, let's get going. Yeah, that's actually a good idea. Get out of here. All right, so they are hallucinating again. Don't really care. Let's go. Go, go, go. Need some fresh air. You ever wonder what would have happened if we went to Japan on vacation instead? Shut up. Would have been awesome, right? This game would have been completely different. We would have been eating sushi, having a lot of fun. I would actually not play the game, but still. Would be a great game. Alright, we didn't go that way, so... Whoa. Oh, thank God. Can we get the fuck out of here, or what's going on? All right. There was there was another spot over there that we didn't explore. I don't want to miss out. Just in case. Ah, oh, there you go. What is that? Ah, oh, not another stupid diary or log or something. Engine room, telegraph log, blah blah blah. I found that you're young to be sober. We read all that. Yeah, we did. Alright, we're good. Anything else? Or... Was that it? Wait, 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 wait. This is where we came from. That's it. It's a dead end. Alright. Let's get going. You gotta walk a little faster, dude. No, seriously, like, don't stop for no reason. I gotta say, the game is actually uh, pretty decent. I just... I'm not used to... Um, the camera angles and all that stuff. It's a very unique game. Some people will not like it. It's not everyone's cup of tea is what I'm trying to say. Oh shit. What do you think? I don't like it. Someone attacked that corpse recently. Too recently. It's pretty weird that whatever damage was done to that thing was done recently. We're just wasting time. Let's go. Totally. And, uh, time is gold. Manchurian gold. Oh, okay. So this could be one of those uh, quick trigger or whatever it's called, quick action moment where we know that the door is about to fall or will fall and we'll have to press, um, I don't know, square or circle or whatever on the controller. And if we're not fast enough, it. we'll also die. Oh, thank God. And it's working. Yep, this is it, all right. Just throw the switch and let's get back upstairs. Okay. Let's get back up there. We'll have to find a new way up. We lost power. It could 
could happen again. We're back up now. Do you read us? Over. Please state your situation. Over. Listen, they took my boat, they kidnapped us, and they are attacking us on the freighter. You have to hurry, please. Over. Recovery mission is on route. Okay. I mean, we are still here, so can we not just turn it back on, or... I guess not. Anyway, guys, I'm gonna stop this gameplay here, but I really appreciate all the help and support and love that you guys have been giving me. You guys are gen genuinely awesome, so thank you. Take care, and uh, until next time, bye.